Hello everyone, welcome back to No Man's Sky 2.33 Permadeath A Journey. Uh, it's weekend community event mission day number 20. <laughs> Not actually in a hurry today, because I want to know if the uh, fix worked. And uh, never noticed that before. I want to know if the fix worked and uh, to see if we can see bases around the points of interest. Now, they can still be on the planet, uh, but they can't be around the points of interest. There's not supposed to be anyway. I just fell asleep watching Ballista Cola again. I'm groggy. Bring some coffee. There's my beautiful freighter. Where are we going? Uh, mission? Aha! Thought it was gonna send me to another star system again. planet so we shouldn't have I can barely hear myself we shouldn't have uh, any problems finding knowledge stones uh, found a Venus flytrap right away All right. let's get up here where we can see everything oh dear there's one <laughs> stream sentinel planet I've got that engine noise. It's irritating. Purple jetpack. <laughs> Purple points of interest. Hiccups. There we go. Thought I could hear a bouncy. God, I hate to do this right at the very beginning, but I don't know why I have the sound. Oh, I don't have one of those. Oh. Darn it. Oh, I can't reload. I'm in a Nexus mission. We just gotta put up with it. I can kill some of it, though. Just kill this sound. There we go. That didn't really help a lot. <laughs> wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. <laughs> I think the jetpack colors have made me crazier than I usually am. <laughs> One more. Uh, there's one. It's kind of, oh, <laughs> it's kind of like Mighty Mouse. <laughs> Here we come to save the day. <laughs> go. All three stones. Now we get to find out if uh, uh, Hello Games is now repeating uh, the, the actual uh, quest, the thing that you got to get. Because uh, last week we had uh, Album and Pearls. So we'll see what this week's going to be. Our brambles. <laughs> hmm. 
Sweet. I realized uh, yesterday after I shut, uh, after I ended the video, and uh, I was looking through my inventory, all of my inventories, that I actually have the uh, nutrient processor on this save that only has 10 slots. And that sucks. But I have tons of empty containers, so. I guess I can do all my cooking on board the freighter. Ugh. All right, here we go. Step through the portcullis. Portcullis. I can. This is ridiculous. How quiet this is. <laughs> I can't uh, affect that particular volume without uh, ending the video. We're on a lush planet. Weekend mission number 20. It's only been seven minutes. Twelve minutes. That cumball is apparently in a language that my game can't translate. <laughs> it's all just a bunch of rectangles. I don't see. Uh, oh, I j we just flew over a monolith, though. I don't see any base computers. Gravestone? Yep. Alrighty. What's it gonna be? Huh. Creature eggs. Collect enzyme fluid. Go feed creatures. Get eggs. So much stuff on my desk again. Alright, creatures that bear eggs. Uh, I don't think that kind does. It might. That's the one it wants me to give it to, so... At the moment, anyway. I was expecting it to be striders. Let's see. It's a big creature. It might have eggs. Enzyme fluid. <laughs> oh, good grief. I gave you food. What'd you do with the food I gave you? I'm an opportunist. Uh, there we go. Oh, it's right next to the poisonous plant. Lovely. Collect eggs. Collect eggs. No? Yeah? Yeah? No? Uh, where'd the other one go? Are they all up there? Alright, let's go up here, guys. I'm not throwing it far enough. There you go. <laughs> There's some eggs. You're not ready yet. There's some. There's some. I don't think we've had this one. I'll have to look back through. Collecting eggs, I mean. 
Are you ready yet? No. Those things are gigantic. Oh, I'll take the milk too. <laughs> Eggs. There we go. We got them all. And the obligatory storm. Good grief. All right. What's that? Oh, a comball. So, for reference. Oh, that's the comball at the portal. Never mind. So, I don't see any base computers. And I don't know if it's a distance thing or. Uh, if no one's dropped one yet. I'll find out later when I uh, do this on my other saves. Look at these cute little things. <laughs> Fermented fruit. I didn't bring that food. I think I have a nutrient processor on me, but I don't know if I have uh, any kind of bait on me. I was just using it to make nanites, so... Alrighty. That only took a couple of minutes. Now the thing is, uh, this is permadeath. So we won't see anything um, unless it's on permadeath. So maybe we should try this uh, in normal mode, just to test it out and see. Uh, portal? There we go. Just to test it out and see uh, if it's working. Rectangle. Hi, Rectangle. <laughs> Wee! <-oo. laughs> I actually bounced off the top there. go. Alrighty. This guy really needs Quicksilver. I spent a ton of Quicksilver on those boots in that jetpack. Silver, and then we will change to um, let's go save. I was trying to decide who I wanted to get the uh, rainbow jetpack on. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, how about the main save? He's got 500 miles on him. He could use a rainbow jetpack. <laughs> and we're already on the anomaly. Woohoo! <laughs> how many uh, quicksilvers do we have? Uh, oh, plenty. Okay, good. I can get over all these invisible walls. <laughs> and investigate the anomalous region.
question is, um, there's a nutrient processor. Well, it gives you plenty of enzyme fluid. You just have to find the animals. It's a super quick one if you happen to land uh, on the mission planet during the daytime. If not, you'll have to move to the daytime side. Or wait. There we go. terrible planet to do this on. <laughs> this fungal planet what time of day is it only 1150 oh, grief we've got monsters t-rexes wow that's quite a ways away there's a huge patch of sodium toxic planets still have that going for them <laughs> probably going to catch up to me while I'm doing this stone. <laughs> All right. God, we got flying creatures. Yikes! Yikes! <laughs> Here's one. That's uh, part of the problem with fungal planets is that knowledge stones aren't very close to each other. Yay. <laughs> Need to fix my toxic protection. stone please all right let's go this way have a, uh, I suppose you saw it, I have a huge, huge collection of these things. Oops. There's one over there. Oh, excuse me. Well, that was just like a normal looking deer with fins on its back. <laughs> have to do that with the rainbow jetpack. <laughs> Back that way. Oh, God, there's tiny little things under my feet. Look at that. 
Here's a save point. Save and chart. <laughs> extra piece of nav data there. So uh, by doing this in permadeath and normal mode, it kind of, uh, look at this one right, sitting right here, kind of limit, eliminates uh, any other mode um, as far as what's going to be on the planet. Because uh, in permadeath, you can see both permadeath and survival bases. Oh, I already got you. Did I scan you, or did I just run away? <laughs> Ow. Oh. <laughs> I punched his lights out. He's unconscious. <laughs> I punched a T-Rex. <laughs> Oh, long way down. <laughs> uh, what's going on with the gun? There we go. It only has what? Oops. <laughs> I'm lucky I didn't get killed. Uh, there we go. That's better. Anxious to uh, watch Mary Lizzie's experience too because uh, she is doing this in multiplayer, or at least the last I looked at her uh, channel of 25 minutes ago, she just switched to multiplayer. So, um, like I said uh, yesterday, in multiplayer, all bets are off. You're in multiplayer, so you're gonna see other people. And uh, so we'll see. Here we go. Lots more combos because it's normal mode. But are there any base computers? I see only combos. About time. It's over there. Same 12 minutes away. I could walk it. We've got plenty of time. But uh, we'll be able to see anything from this ship anyway. Oh, there's a transmission tower right there. I don't see any base computers. And they've had 25 minutes, so... It's pretty groovy. It is uh, nighttime here, though, so we'll get the mission. Oh, there's a base computer right on top of the POI. Well, that sucks. Look at that. Right on top of the POI is a base. Oh, the sun's coming up good. We don't have to go anywhere else. Take the enzyme fluid. Come over here. Take a screenshot. There's the POI. There's the base computer. And it disappears. It works. 
that's how you make them disappear is by taking a picture and reporting them. It doesn't actually report it to uh, Hello Games. It's not like you're getting someone in trouble. It just takes it out of your game. And now if you could do that uh, with as many bases as were there before, that would be something else. But you could you could never do it. There was there was dozens of bases, you know. Can't feed just one animal. It'll take forever. But you can have some anyway. Oh. <laughs> there we go. There you go. There's a fight. What about you? Didn't see that guy last time. He likes scented herbs. Can you reach the food? Yep. Alright. Where's all your friends? Uh, there's one. He's too far away. I don't think they'll keep up with each other. Are you following me? Come on. Come over here. Come on. Oh, he doesn't want to follow me. Okay. Sometimes you can get them to follow you. Here's some enzyme fluids. Enzyme fluids. Good grief. <laughs> we got triceratopses. I think you should probably take damage when they step on you. I mean, they're gigantic. What are they? 6.2 meters. There we go. Got to get out of the dehydrogen here. Hey, give me my stuff. <laughs> I can't keep up with him. Come back here. Give me my stuff. I paid you. <laughs> there was a second animal, wasn't there? Oh, the dogs are going crazy. How much time left? Oh, <laughs> backing up as fast as I can. <laughs> yet. Oh, you didn't eat anything. <laughs> oh, I hit him in the face with it. <laughs> Interested in a new friend. Give me my eggs. <laughs> eggs. <laughs> I need two more. Feeling full. Here we go. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Up. <laughs> so I guess the uh, the limit on space for that uh, unless they use the save editor editor to uh, drop that base in there, uh, the limit on space around the, the POI is very much. But they could have used the save ed editor to, to drop that base right there. Alrighty. That looked like a rocket ship with wings, like from a cartoon. <laughs> that shuttle. <laughs> Let's go get Rainbow Jetpack. 
Come on, bright wings. There we go. Uh, hi. <laughs> The only time I ever use a com ball is uh, on a multi-tool or a crash ship site or when I visit a base um, to say thank you. Um, I don't uh, I don't try to spam anything like this, you know, dozens of multi-tools on a portal. I do use them occasionally though. Back to the anomaly. Well, you can see it's a super fast mission. I got two saves done in the space of 30 minutes. I think it's actually only better than like 26 minutes. Oh, God. <laughs> Can't get there from here. Alrighty. We were upside down. Go get this. Oh, park me as far away as possible. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we'll go get this jetpack and uh, go to a base. See what it looks like. Completo. Oh, nip nip buds. I didn't even look at what the prize was. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, we can get the umbrella tree too. We'll do that. And rainbow jetpack goodness. Put it on. <laughs> now I'll really be able to tell my saves apart. Number three. That's a keeper. <laughs> Have to pick a good base though. Let's see. I don't, honestly, I don't even know what galaxy I'm in right now. Uh, let's see here. This is Ocean Beaches. Um, Terminus. Suisus. Uh, perfect planet. All right. I'll bite. <laughs> Which perfect planet? <laughs> Good grief. Hello. There we are. <laughs> Aw. Mabazez Minor. Oh, what do we got going on in here? Oh, I vaguely remember this place. Oh, that's the wrong guy. This is the guy I wanted. No, not the refiner. This goofball. <laughs> Get planetary data. Get uh, 620 nanites. Woohoo! I... I remember this place, kind of. Wow. It's not powered yet. Woo! <laughs> wow, that's bright. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wonder Sword giggles like a little girl when he's using his jetpack. <laughs> it was super... Super bright. Woo! <laughs> That's 
so funny. I remember like building this little outbuilding right here. <laughs> Here's one of my save points. There's my booster. Oh my god. <laughs> I think this is in this has to be this has to be in Euclid, I think. Although I'm not sure about that. Um let's see here. Uh, biofuel reactor, uh, power, fuel, this might take a minute. <laughs> All right, what do we got? for space stations. There's no way current system is going to be in here. Uh, ice and Tam, Euclid, and whatever this is. I don't know what galaxy this is. <laughs> Alright, let's go find out what galaxy this is. The only way I know to know how this is a beautiful planet. I'd hang out here for a minute. It's the only way I know to find out. We are in Hilbert. All right. <laughs> Glad it says something on the thing. You used to actually have to warp somewhere and get the entrance to the new system screen, if that makes any sense, to find out what galaxy you were in. <laughs> Well, this is a pretty gosh darn nice planet. And this is not where I just was. Oh, bummer, the planet disappeared. Oh. All right. Let's go to the space station. Where is it at? <laughs> the surface of the planet disappeared. <laughs> That's too bad. <laughs> I'm glad that happened now and not when I teleported in. <laughs> We'd have had to swim around looking for our ship and some land. All right, all that craziness and silliness and the rainbow jetpack. I want to thank you all so much for coming along. That was weekend mission number 20, twice in a row. And uh, we will be back tomorrow with more permadeath goodness. Uh, and have a great day. 